When you hear crypto wallet, what comes to mind? Is it a place to store digital coins or something more abstract? You might picture a digital pouch overflowing with shiny coins, neatly stacked bills or some other representation of digital wealth. But that's not how it works at all. That's a common misconception that can lead to confusion. A crypto wallet isn't a container for coins, tokens or any other digital assets, it doesn't physically hold anything. Instead, it's your secure access point, your personal gateway, to interact with the blockchain. Your wallet doesn't hold crypto. Think of it more like a window to your holdings. It holds secret codes, private keys, that are mathematically linked to your assets on the blockchain. These keys are what prove you own the assets recorded on the blockchain, allowing you to manage and transact with them. Think of it like a deed to land, a legal document that establishes your ownership. You don't physically carry the land around with you, do you? You just carry the proof you own it, the deed itself. The blockchain is the public registry, the official record of who owns what. Your wallet with its private keys is the digital equivalent of that deed. This fundamental difference is crucial for understanding crypto security and how to protect your digital assets. Choosing a wallet isn't just about convenience, it's about taking direct control of your assets and your financial future. It's not just about picking an app with a pretty interface. You become your own bank, managing your own security and transactions. This comes with all the freedom and responsibility that self-sovereignty brings. So, forget the outdated idea of a digital pouch or container. Your wallet is your key to financial sovereignty, granting you control over your digital wealth. Let's dive deeper into how it all works, exploring the mechanics and security aspects of crypto wallets. In the world of cryptocurrency, the concept of a wallet takes on a whole new meaning. It's not just about holding physical coins or even digital representations of them. If your wallet doesn't hold coins, what does it hold? Keys, specifically, cryptographic keys. These aren't your everyday keys. They're complex algorithms that grant you access to your digital assets. Your wallet is essentially a secure digital keychain designed to manage and protect these vital cryptographic keys. Think of it as a high-tech vault for your digital identity and assets. It's responsible for generating and storing private keys, the secret codes that allow you to authorize transactions and prove ownership of your crypto. These private keys are the only way to unlock your funds on the blockchain, granting you complete control over your digital wealth. Without these keys, your crypto is just a string of numbers, an abstract concept that you can't touch or use. They become inaccessible, lost in the digital ether. Imagine a transparent safe in a public square, everyone sees what's inside, the contents are visible for all to see, but only you have the key, only you possess the means to open it and access what's inside. In traditional banking, the bank holds the keys, they control access to your funds and manage your accounts on your behalf. In crypto, you do, this is called self-custody. You are your own bank, responsible for securing your own assets. True ownership means only you control your funds. You have the power to decide what happens to your digital assets. No one can freeze or take them without your keys. Your assets are protected from censorship and seizure. The focus isn't on protecting coins, they're secured by the blockchain. The underlying technology ensures their integrity. But on protecting your keys. They are the gateway to your digital wealth and their security is paramount. Lose your keys, lose your funds. There's no safety net, no central authority to appeal to, no recovery, no customer service. You are solely responsible for the security of your keys and your funds. If someone else gets your keys, they get your crypto. They can access your wallet and transfer your funds without your permission. Your wallet's main job is to generate and guard your keys, so only you can use them. It's your personal fortress, protecting your digital assets from unauthorized access. That's the heart of crypto security. Understanding this fundamental principle is crucial for navigating the world of digital assets safely and responsibly. Your digital wallet holds two distinct keys, each serving a unique and crucial purpose in the world of cryptocurrency, a public key and a private key. Understanding the difference between these two is fundamental to grasping how crypto transactions work and how to keep your assets secure. Think of the public key as your mailing address. It's perfectly safe to share with anyone and everyone. This key is specifically used to receive crypto. It's how people know where to send your digital currency. You can give your public key to anyone. They can use it to send you funds, knowing that the transaction will reach your wallet. However, having your public key doesn't grant them any access to your wallet or the ability to move your funds. It's purely for receiving. 
Now the private key is like your mailbox key, and you should absolutely never share it with anyone, under any circumstances. This private key is the digital signature that proves you are the rightful owner of your crypto assets. It's also what allows you to authorize transactions and send crypto to others. So, when you initiate a crypto transfer, your wallet automatically uses your private key to create a digital signature, effectively signing the transaction. This signature serves as irrefutable proof that the transaction is genuinely from you and authorized by you. Public and private keys aren't just randomly generated, they are intricately and mathematically linked, but despite this connection, it's computationally impossible to derive or guess one key from the other. This ingenious system ensures that things remain both open and secure, meaning anyone can verify and see public addresses and transactions on the blockchain, but only you, with your private key, have the power to actually move the funds associated with those addresses. Fortunately, your crypto wallet handles all the complex cryptography behind the scenes automatically. Your primary responsibility is to safeguard and protect your private key from unauthorized access, because if you happen to lose or expose your private key to someone else, then your entire cryptocurrency holdings are immediately at risk of being stolen. Therefore, guard your private key with the utmost care, treating it like your most valuable possession, because in the digital world, it truly is. Where you store your keys matters. Wallets are either hot or cold. Hot wallets are connected to the internet apps, software, web wallets. Super convenient for daily use but more vulnerable to hacks. Think of a hot wallet like cash in your pocket. Great for spending but not for your life savings. Cold wallets are offline like hardware devices or paper wallets. They're the gold standard for security. Use a cold wallet for long-term storage, like a safe or vault for your most valuable assets. Cold wallets are less convenient but much safer from online threats. For most people the best strategy is both a hot wallet for spending a cold wallet for savings. That way you get convenience and top tier security. Choose wisely based on how you use your crypto. Your wallet setup is your first line of defense. In crypto you're your own bank and security chief. There's no insurance or fraud department. If your crypto is stolen it's gone. Protect your private keys and seed phrase above all else. Your seed phrase is the master key. Write it down and store it offline, never digitally. Never share your seed phrase or private key with anyone, ever. Watch out for scams, fake giveaways, phishing emails and lookalike websites are everywhere. If it sounds too good to be true, it is. No legit company will ever ask for your keys or seed phrase. Use strong, unique passwords and enable two-factor authentication. Keep your devices updated to guard against malware. A few extra minutes of security can save you from losing everything. Crypto wallets can seem overwhelming but every expert started as a beginner. Learning the basics puts you in control of your financial future. Crypto lets you hold your own assets and transact freely, no banks required. Your wallet is a symbol of self-sovereignty and financial freedom. Start small, set up a wallet, send a tiny amount, and get comfortable. Once you're ready, consider a hardware wallet for long-term savings. The key is to learn by doing. Confidence comes with experience. Ask questions, stay curious, and keep learning. By mastering wallets, you're joining a financial revolution. Secure your wallet and take your first step into the future of finance.